right, now this is going to be a rambling video, but we have to talk about the alt-right because I am seeing some crazy stuff online. People are getting really upset if I or anybody else criticizes the alt-right or dares to equate them with racists or racism. And I don't, I don't understand why. Because it's not like the internet doesn't exist. You can hop on Google right now and in their own words find out who started the alt-right movement, why they started it, what they want, who coined the phrase alt-right, and who controls it to this day. You can find that information out right now. You don't have to guess. You don't have to make up your own reasoning behind what the alt-right is. I mean, I think a lot of people think that the alt-right means that, oh, well, you don't like the Republican establishment and you voted for Trump to drain the swamp. No, that's not what being alt-right means. Not at all. It's not about stupid memes or anything like that, okay? Look up a guy named Richard B. Spencer, and I've talked about him many, many times before, because I keep hearing people say things like, Hillary Clinton, you know, she started the whole alt-right thing, or it was Barack Obama or the mainstream media. They're the ones that started using that term, so we just adopted it. No. No. That's not true at all. I mean, not at all. Up to two years ago, Richard Spencer was doing interviews with people. And I'll try to see if I can find some and put links in the description box down below. Or you could just, you know, do the Google foo yourself. But he was doing interviews saying how and why and that he, in fact, did coin the phrase alt-right. And he did it because, you know, well, white nationalism and white supremacy, these are just things that people shy away from. So we needed, we needed a, a new name to be sympathetic, to bring people into our cause so they could see what we really, really want. Yeah, they, they're, they're racist. What they want is an all-white, all-Christian nation backed by a big government to enforce these things. Not only are they, in fact, racist, but they're not even really right-wing. They're not conservative, they don't believe in small government, and they don't believe in freedom and liberty. They're not alt-right at all. They're not right. They're some other weird racist nutjob group closely associated with Nazis and the KKK. That's what they are. Don't call yourself alt-right if you don't know what alt-right means. It actually does mean a specific thing, not just whatever you think you want it to mean. Okay, if you like frog memes online, that doesn't make you alt-right, okay? Don't call yourself that if you don't want to be called a racist. We need to be making that movement shrink and go away so we can protect true conservative values, true freedom and liberty from the nut job Antifa on the left. Not by emboldening these racist assholes. It doesn't make any sense whatsoever. The alt-right is a bad thing. They are a bunch of racists, period. That's where they started, and that's where they continue to be to this day. Racists control the alt-right movement. Stop associating yourself with a bunch of racists.